Yes, hello everyone. Welcome to the next Femete video tutorial. Now, guys, for this episode, I'm going to actually show you how to use Accent and um, the Accent and Axe Return section on your mixer. Now, this is the Behringer X1832. Um, that's the model number. So, a lot of persons who have mixers that are similar to this are basically any mixer that comes with the accents and the ax return feature a lot of persons don't use it now for those persons who have pa system or sound system and that actually use a lot of effects um, units and effects units are basically um, units are musical components that actually add an extra boost to your system in terms of increasing um, bass, increasing the harmony. Um, for example, I would have just purchased one of the Behringer um, Exciter, Sonic Exciter, and definitely I'm going to show you how I'm going to actually um, connect with that one. So effect units such as expanders such as bbe sonic maximizer all those are effects unit um a lot of persons connect it different ways so one way to connect it, those units is to basically use the accent and the ax return feature definitely there's an advantage so let's say for example i have my Behringer Exciter. Now I'm going to use um, this cable. It is actually a quarter jack. So, definitely, what I will do is to plug it into Accent 1. So, this is now basically going to send out a signal. I'm going to send out the signal to my Exciter. So, this now will now plug into my exciter now definitely i will be using a y cable this is just a single one so i'll be sending it um to the exciter with a y cable so i'm gonna plug one to the left channel of the exciter and one to the right side of the exciter now uh, that this cable now basically, as I said, will be sending signal to the exciter. Now when that exciter um, do all of its processing and boost up the signal, then I need to get the signal back to this mixer. So it can now be sent out to my amplifiers, my EQ, and then of course, definitely the speakers. So that's where the AX return section come into play. So the signal from the exciter it need to return i need to come back into this mixer board so again definitely um this cable now returning the signal um remember i'm using the accent one so i'm gonna plug it into the right and into the left understand so it is now returning the signal after it would have been processed and send it into right and left definitely again i will be using a y cable there to get it to the right and to get it to the left now once you would have done that send and return now this is the good thing about the ax one about the using the accent and ax return now when you do that guys all of these channels will be able to benefit from that exciter and that is why you actually have um these knobs as you realize they are labeled as ox and you have one so definitely let's say for example i'm using channel one as a mic now the mic system whenever that um, person is singing for example 
Now that exciter can actually add some harmony to the vocal that is coming from that person that is actually um, singing. And that is definitely because you will use um, this knob to control to control how much processing that exciter does for you. Let's say for example, um, over here, um, channel 12, channel 13, um, these channels, I normally use these channels to put in audio um, input, for example, coming from my DJ controller. So definitely I'm playing some music and I actually want to get a much more deeper bass um, from the exciter, then definitely um, use a knob there to actually um, control it. So that's how it actually works. So all these channels will benefit from all those um, effector unit once you use the accent and the axe return and if you realize we have two so let's say for example i'm now using a dbx um, expander then i will now utilize um, the accent two so send it from accent two to that dbx um, expander that expander definitely gonna do all of its processing and I now need to get it back into the mixer board. Then I will now use a Y cable to get it in um, the return, the stair return, right and left, of course. So that's how you actually use the accent and the ax return section of your mixer board. Now, a lot of uh, mixers definitely come with that section. Just that, as I said, a lot of persons don't utilize um that section so once again guys if you're new to my youtube channel please remember to click on the subscription button of course leave your comments in the comment section of the video and share the video so once again guys um thanks for viewing family tech is out of here